Well, hello everyone, welcome to another episode on the Reloaded Saber Run. Episode 2, it has been probably a couple of days since the last episode, and we have made a lot of progress. If you're and if you're wondering, that house not is there is not mine. That one is. Uh, I am not exactly the best builder in the world. That house up there on the cliff actually belongs to Whispering Stars, who I think is getting close to being done. We are trying to design our own house because I think there's a competition of sorts to try and see if you can build the best house. So I've got a little bit of an idea of one. I kind of want this to, I kind of want a, not a rectangle, a square house, but kind of like this and then it's gonna go up a layer, be a bit bigger on the house and so on and so forth. This I'm thinking should be a bit of an outdoor area but it's going to be a little bit different. So I'm not quite sure yet. Potentially a potentially a horse area. I'm not quite sure yet. But we might as well uh, actually hop on a call with stars and see what they're up to. Well, well, stars, I see your house is nearing completion. Unlike mine. I'm 81% done. 81% done. But I'm going done. to sob. It has so many different blocks. I still need two stacks of dark oak stairs. I've got, I've got a fair bit of wood if you want it. Um, fine, it's fine. Like my, your house has got like at least what seven, eight, different, nine, ten different kinds of blocks. Mine has about two. Uh, I've got. I have a materialist. I can tell you. <laughs> I don't. I've just, I've just built out a tough and. Uh, actually, no, I've got three blocks. I've got tough, and i got dark oak logs, and I have dark oak staircases. That's it. Uh, my house has 2,360 total blocks. It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 25 different types of of block. Splash. Because I have nothing, you know, nothing says starter house, like mushroom stem. <laughs> See, I was thinking of just draining the entire monument and building in there and claiming that as my starter house, just to flex. Do it. And then I got, and then I got, Gemini Tay, season nine. And then I got killed by a guardian, so I thought, mm, maybe not. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> Pretty much. It was like day second one, get in. Oh, wait, no. That's probably not a good idea. I need redwood. I've got mangrove wood. Yes, I can, I can see. Yeah, fast. So, any hoodoo doodle. -doo, I don't really have a plan for this uh, house other than it's going to be a house with a roof. More than mine has right now. Well, my house has doesn't even have four walls. Well, it's sort of got four walls, but I'm going to destroy, destroy one of the walls. Oh. As you do. As you do. Did I get all of the logs? I did not. Cherry trees are not nearly as annoying to farm as mangrove or acacia. No, I was going to say them. I just said. But they seem, are kind of annoying. I assume they're kind of like acacia in the way they're farmed. They are kind of like acacia. Actually, I think I'm going to put this back block because that gives me a bit more of that. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just thinking out loud here. House design is not one of the things I, I specialize I in. I chop a tree. All right, so if I then... Okay, do... I need... I need 24 slabs. I need... I've got slabs. Dark oak slabs? Dark oak slabs, I think. No, I don't. I've got dark oak trap doors. Okay, no, I don't need those. I they... need... I do need cherry trap doors. Well, fun. It sounds like we we're having a lot of uh, fun building these houses. <laughs> Mental breakdown. Here we come. Oh, we're past mental breakdown. That doesn't sound like a good thing. 
I don't want dark oak trapdoors. I want cherry trapdoors. I'm sorry, but... Uh, oh, I was talking to the crafting table. Same diff. All right. Let's get this mini roof done, and then we can do something with it. Well, I'm thinking here that I'm going to have this kind of roof that goes to from here to this part of the bit, which this is going to be open air with access only here. But I'm looking at that roof; it's not quite popping out for me. I think it needs to be a bit a little bit narrower, kind of like this gentle slope. Maybe curve up a bit more gently and go down that way. The trouble is I can't get as much on this side because of the way I've built the wall. So I'm going to have to redesign this just a tiny bit more, I think. So after a little bit of consideration, I've decided to rebuild the at least the front structure of the house. You can see I've already redone the roof over here. And I've also added, made this wall come forward a bit. So it does mean I can now do a different wall face here. Now I'm not entirely satisfied with this and I did play around a little bit with it. I think it just needs a little bit more colour and potentially acacia, although maybe cherry might work as well. I did think about putting some fences here. Let's see. Kind of looks weird without the... Kind of looks weird without this, actually, because I was, again, once trying out. And I think it really needs the yellow there just to make it a little bit pop out. That doesn't seem to work. I'm going to try a bit of cherry since stars does seem to have some cherry available, and we'll see how that goes. Well, a little bit more time has passed, and I've made a little bit more progress on this. I have, I'm still not entirely sure about the pink, but I think this is going to work, and if I put some glass in there, it should work quite well. So, uh, you might also notice I've done a bit more of the framing, which I'm not entirely sold on that, because I think that needs to go back in. Oh, and assuming I don't die to a uh, zombie. We'll just quickly get rid of this guy. There we go. And it stops raining. Excellent. So, uh, I think the this is not exactly the way I want it to be. And I'm not exactly sure what I want the walls to be yet either. So, a little bit of complications. Now, you might also notice I've got a whole stack of sniffer rigs around. And I think that's because, uh, what's his name? RW has placed a few in. Why are there so many mobs about? So annoying. Anyway, uh, so it looks like RW has placed off, uh, I think it's 11 sniffer eggs. So we're going to have to quickly gather those up so we don't, so we can, le uh, so we can place those down later. And looks like I've got an advancement for that. So what do we think of my house? Get off my horse too. I like this part. This and is my favorite part. Yes, I, I do like the horse pen. It does need to be a bit more green. Yeah, don't do that. You die. Anyway, what do you think of the rest of the house? Don't look inside. That's not finished. Hmm. Hazardous. Very Hazardous. Hazardous. I mean, yes, true. Very hazard. I have fallen off multiple times. Have you gone for an even number? Why would you do that? Why? Why? Yeah, it has made things a little bit more difficult, I'll be honest. <laughs> um, Why have you done this? I, might... I like the dark oak with the mangrove. Yeah. I don't know about the, the jungle and the pink together there. I mean, the pink is just, there is... I did say don't go inside, it's not finished. But, um, I like, sure. this bit is rather big. The ta I did think about doing a tower, although I think the double story is going to be a bit too hard. I think you should cut it off right here. Just no. What? Just do it to have yeah. a tiny house? I'll do two stories. It's not tiny. This is quite large. Uh, watch out behind you. Ow. Um, I was quite willing to burn, but okay, thank you. So you think I should have, what, a, a pretty small house? A double story. Yeah, what is your horse doing? Jumping. Um, so I'm, I'm thinking, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I do like, I do. Okay, my advice, either. I do want that wall there. 
you make it this big. Sorry, back. Yeah. Yong. Or you can make it larger, but single story with a tall roof. And I think you need to gradient the pink in. It is too pastel against the darker color. You've got like gothic vampire vibes. It's and quite right. Then you've got fairy princess vibes. <laughs> um, I don't think I really want the princess vibe. I think I'd take the. Oh, I don't know. This is so. This is this is why I don't build houses. This is why I build in creative. Um, my if I had a if I had my way, my starter house would be this, and literally only this. It doesn't quite work in third person. Uh, but since you can't put a bed in it, um, it's a little bit small. Get in the hole. Yes, fine. See, this is this is exactly hey, problem solved. This is exactly what I was hoping for in a house. But no, uh, aside so roomy. aside from the lack of any light or food source or bed uh, or roof, or oh, actually no, it does have a roof. Anyway, aside from the all roof? the, I was kind. I gave you a roof over your head. Yes, that's oh, that's, that's quite literally all you did. Stairs. Anyway, um. See, I do like the, I do like the wall set back above that's near the stable, mm. but at the same time, it's like that's probably the only bit I like about the second story. Never build anything that uses stairs. Why? So many. Yeah. Oh yeah. True. All right, so I think I'll rip down this. I'll try and rip down the second story and see what it looks like. I'm not too happy about it, but I think it's going to be the better for the long run. I'm, to be fair, this isn't going to be my permanent house anyway. No, you want to be one with the fishies. Yes, the spiky fishies, especially. I don't guardians and spiky fish. They don't really rhyme. They don't really well. They don't really go together, but. Anywho, well, thanks for that advice. Yes, yes. I will take it in mind, keep it in mind. And now we build a shop. Oh yeah, true. Well, after that little uh, time lapse of building a st shop with Star, it's actually going to be their shop more than mine because I think I'm going to be doing something different. But yeah, it was just a little bit of a time lapse helping them build a shop. But anyway, after that little bit, I have actually taken Star's advice and decided to redesign this shop. Let me just quickly turn my microphone off. There we go. And I think this is going to be my house. This is going to work a lot better, I reckon. Um, the taller roof and the house in general 
works a little bit better and I think I may still do something here but it's going to be a little bit more smaller and possibly a little bit more maybe a little bit more rundown I'm not entirely sure I don't have that much longer to be able to fix up this house before it needs to be submitted for the competition I believe so let's figure out what we're going to do with it as well and after a few uh, hours actually of thinking about it and building a little bit more I have actually completed the house, or at least the outside of the house. I decided to go with the rather simple, actually, acacia thing, although I'm not entirely happy with it. Still need something to break it up. You can see there's just devil wall here. I could, I suppose, go with the full on, the full, what do we do, this um, full glass here. Or I could actually do what Stars has done on, the, on their build. And if we just zoom in a bit, we can see they've done, be able to fill a four guy a four space with something that looks like a window so I might try that here uh, if I can get my acacia out where did I put it where did it go there it is so if I put um, a different kind of wood a different kind of thing above here where, where, I'll keep losing these blocks it's not fun so if I put another kind of trapdoor there maybe a red or a mangrove trapdoor if I have any which I do, there we go, and that sh could work a little bit better. Um, no, that's not quite what I want, I think. I might need to get rid of these things here that were adding depth, and do it like this, and the, no, that's not it either. Hmm, how did stars do it? That's a good question. Oh, did okay. Stars just did that one, and then they did a um something like that. No, the other way. They did it. Um. There we go. That looks a little bit better. Mm, still not happy with it. I'm gonna have to do a little bit more thinking on this. But overall, the house is actually finished. I just need to do a little bit of clean up on the inside because this doesn't look like the best house in the world and we'll go on from there. So I've been doing a little bit of thinking about this and I think I might actually go with this design instead of having the two windows on the sides and leaving a two wide gap in the middle, which I think is the reason why this isn't working as well. I'm also going to, I'm going to go with the two wide window. I could go with the four wide window, I suppose, but that might be a bit big and make it over here. The problem is I've made it six, which is really annoying. I suppose I could make it, well, I could potentially go one, two, three, four, block there. One, two, three, block there. And that would be four there, but that would look uneven, I think. And I don't really want to get rid of the glass that I've put down because I don't have silk touch on my picks yet, or really anything. So, so let's have a, tr yeah, let's rip this down and see how this goes with the double over there. Because I think it might look better if I varied it up a little bit as well. And one thing actually, now that I've got the space, is to uh, put a little bit of, uh, deliberate holes in this kind of thing. So just like that kind of kind of deal just to make make it look not as perfect as it is and actually to make sure that that is also uh, white or birch planks. So that looks a little bit better and same over here where I've got the acacia instead of the white that needs to be uh, birch. Let's make that birch. There we go. So I think that looks a little bit better, it's just broke, broken up just a little bit more and that should work better I think. And with a little bit more decoration with the rose and the pink, ch the cherry, uh, what do you call it, cherry leaves, I think that's actually going to work a lot better. That has most definitely improved the look of the build entirely. Now, I'm probably not going to work on the inside actually, it's just going to be a dumping ground for things until I actually uh, move out of here into the main base, which I hopefully will have a look at in the next couple of episodes. I'm not really sure yet, or I actually did a little bit of changing around here as well with some of the mangrove wood as well as the crimson wood. I think that's not the best look in the world, but it's definitely better than it was. So with that, we're going to say thank you very much for watching. Oh yeah, I got diamond stuff as well. I think Stars very generously gave me uh, a whole stack of diamond things and I bought myself a shield. So uh, anyway, we're going to say thank you very much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.